Right, John, tell us about your oh, costume. Oh, no, 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 no. I'll tap my watch off. So, r remind us again the name of your character today. Uh, today, I'm uh, portraying a character who I've given the name to, of Robert Smee. And today, Robert Smee is um, an executioner, but sometimes he appears as a barber surgeon. So it's a, it's a genetic name for a character that recreates uh, different aspects of life and society in, in the, the uh, late Tudor, early, early Stuart period. And uh, in order to, to try and achieve a level of authenticity, we strive to make sure our costumes are correct. Uh, and in that respect, some of our costumes we make ourselves, uh, others we have made for us by uh, professional costume makers. Uh, and in, in that process, we work hard to make sure that the um, uh, the fabrics are correct. Now for instance in this period there was no cotton so I've just put on a linen shirt and this is a handmade linen shirt and it is appropriate for the period uh, and the clothing that you'll see me uh, putting on in a moment uh, some of it we, we've um, we've had made other things we've made ourselves and it'll be um, uh, a working man's costume uh, slightly above the lesser sort so it'll be a, a form of doublet and some breeches and stockings and such like. And you'll see as I go through the different type of materials. But there's no, nothing synthetic. It's, it's, all, it's all natural materials.